Let's examine a hypothetical. Say you were given a choice to study with me here at home or be a normal girl with a normal upbringing. Dow houses, ballet, a mommy who baked cookies, never an unhappy day in your life, never an original thought in your skull. What do you choose then? I don't know. I guess I've never been that way. You've got an audience. They look good on you. You're those Rayburn kids, right? No. We're the other ones. Don't you ever wonder what it would be like to just be normal? You'd hate it. I think you should make friends with that kid from the drugstore. You had him the moment he saw you. It's great that you and your brother are so close. If I just spend more than 50 minutes with my sister, I think one of us would kill the other. I just think it's different with us. I've built you two a lovely little world. You'd find yourself lost in the real world. You'd go to hell. Jack. You promised you wouldn't go crazy. Just a couple of pills. Jack, please. We don't need him anymore. Tell him to take a hike. All those years under my careful tutelage? And what is the end result? I'm done with you. Both of you, get out of here. I'm Josie Rayburn. Oh, right. I've been hearing about you since I started teaching. Not for my father. No. So every time his name comes up, somebody always says, wait till you meet his kids. You're good looking and smart and all the things that we seem to really like people for these days. We'll go somewhere good in the big city. It's three fifty a month. You're late, you're out. You didn't tell me this was a part of the plan. We should hang out. You can tell me all your brother's dirty little secrets. Are you sure you want to know? She's got a two-bedroom on the Upper West Side and the rent comes straight out of her trust fund. You guys can take care of everything, right? Like it was our own. Except it's not. There's a gap between us and them. We're different. We're better. I'm the only person who's ever loved you. You like this life. All of this was your idea. You're so naive. Everything I did, I did for you.